I have the goods. Y'all ain't gonna believe this. You remember when I was on live with y'all just a second ago? <laughs> well, yesterday. And, uh, boom. Girl, I went to fix up my stuff, laid down, and burnt up the tails. Girl, look at the tail. We're gonna roll with it, though. We're gonna roll with it. Now, let's go! Cause! Yo, what up, what it is, and what it do? This is your favorite cousin, and I am back with another banger. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the little bell notification so you can be notified when your favorite cousin posts another video. Who got the goods. What we have prepared for us today is some good old king crab, some sausage, a lobster tail, some eggs, some corn, and some purple potatoes. I know I'm excited. And what we're going to be doing today is the one bite challenge. Shout out to Queen Beast and Beast Mall and TKC and everybody else that done, done, done it. <laughs> My little belly self fit to do it. Before we get into this good old bite, let's go ahead and get this prayer because my head, my hand, I know, I cut it. Yeah, I cut it. I was cutting up some chicken and I cut my hand. I did it. About God, thank you so much once again for the food that you have prepared before my body, Lord God. Lord God, please heal my hand, Lord. Lord God, when I go to the doctor, please just let me have no anxiety, Lord God, because you know my struggles, Lord. And I just want to say thank you for whatever it is you're about to do for all 258,000 of us, Lord God. You are so worthy to be praised. Every step of the way, we are counting on you to be there with us, Lord, and we know you will never let us down. So we're counting on that. We're counting on your grace, your forgiveness. We're counting on your strength, your understanding. As for me, no nerves, no anxiety, Lord God. Calm me down and stop let me move so fast Lord God I am at your mercy and I just want to say thank you in your name I pray amen now I got a whole bookshelf up hold on now oh let's go ahead and get into this bye we're gonna do it cause I gotta wrap up my good my my bad hand <laughs> I gotta wrap it up yeah I cut my hand cutting um cutting chicken and I, I cut it fiercely if that's, if that's the way to put it here. Yeah, I don't think that's the way to put it. I think it's worse than fiercely, but we're going to go get it checked out tomorrow. I made my mind up. Let's get to this bike. We're going to do it. Right, we're going to start with a little bit of lobster tail first. Because look how I did that tail. I don't mind. It worth a damn. This damn show is going to be one bite here because it's got to be. Get that. We got the goods. Oh, my Lord. I know that sounds hot. I come here every day and do the same thing in every video. Huh? I know it. That's what. Now I know I'm accident prone. Okay. I only got one good hand. But I don't know. Bro, I burnt the seafood. I did it. Remember we had cooked this in the oven? Oh, that's sauce hot. Remember? Cook these in the oven, and when you cook them in the oven, if you leave them in there too long, you kind of look at that. You see that? I know that better be some good little meat here. Never say that again, actually. You know, you shall not. But I had left it and it dried out. All right, let's do it. Is that thumbnail? Nope, one bite. Better than ball. It do. It do. It do. <sighs> Somebody was a little thirsty. Baked seafood is better than ball. I got a. Yesterday we had baked it. So if you don't know how, check the live under this video right here, and it'll be right there to show you how to bake it. Cause boo, hold on now, give me that. That's good meat. I couldn't find the um. You know my one bite challenge ain't going the way that I planned. It ain't. Everything here so little. Bitch start sweating again. I'm gonna eat. I guess this is where the challenge comes in. Oh! All right. All right. One bite. Mm. 
Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Damn. I'm just gonna sweat. Oh. I'm just gonna sweat. I am. Mm -mm. So hot to say it. That's another reason why I'm going to get my hand checked out. It was so many doctors in the comments yesterday. I appreciate all y'all. But somebody said the reason why I could be sweating and feeling a little queasy and weak is because it probably could have been infected. But y'all, I'm going to get it checked out tomorrow. I pinky promise. I pinky promise, which is today for you. So after you see this video, either I done already went or I'm about to go. Mm -mm -mm. And I'll let y'all know. How it went. I will. Now, I got to show y'all these because this was impressive to me. I'm not going to eat this one. Well, this ain't no one bite. But look at this. Look at that. You see that? It's purple. This is a purple potato, sweetie. It's purple. You see that? I said, wow. That's nice. I never had one. Let me get a little bite for I can put it. Yeah, it's a potato. It's a potato. It is. It's a potato. Tastes just like a potato. <laughs> Got the purple potato. Oh! That's hot. Alright. You know, it's challenging for me. It ain't. It's not. It's not. I know it. I'm about giving up. Because I know when I get to that sausage. When I get to this here. This ain't gonna be no one bite. We're gonna hit it with a little up. Yeah, that's it. Hell no. that summer going down too cuz look at that laugh at that summer going down that might be a thumbnail whatever one bite hold up Supposed to be the one bite challenge. I know it, but this ain't can't won't will not. But -do. call me a cheater. Call me what you want. No, no. <laughs> Did y'all see when it was Beast Mode time and Queen Beast? Queen Beast, we salute you. Love it. Me won't do it. I ain't doing it. Hell no. Mm -hmm. I that might with them. But -do. that's it for me. I'm about done here anyway. I am. No, I had told y'all on the live earlier that I really wasn't feeling good, and when my hand started back doing what it was doing, I had went to fix it, and I went to take me a nap, simple, because I really wasn't feeling like up to par. I, after the nap, I kind of feel a little better, just a dab better, you know. But tomorrow, I'm going to get my hand checked because when I kept hitting it. It kind of like opened back up, and I ain't no doctor, so I'm going to do the right thing. Oh, let's go ahead and get into this conversation. Happy freaking Tuesday, my love. I hope this video reaches you well. I know a lot of people are going to be asking. 
I cut my hand on some uh I cut my hand on a knife when I was chopping some chicken. I went down doing what I love. I did. <laughs> I went down doing what I love, but oh I think it's bad enough that we need to go to the hospital. I mean to the uh urgent care and probably get some stitches in that some gun because I don't want this to get infected. Even though I'm hard headed and I do not like hospitals, doctors, I don't like none of that. I don't. But health is wealth. And I need my left hand. You know, I really don't, but I'm gonna go and get a check. <laughs> anyway, I don't know where that laugh came from. I hope this video reaches you well. I'm in here sweating like a Hebrew slave. Cause you know what, man? I'll tell you what. God has been so freaking good to us, man. Like he's been so good to us. Even when we think we're at our worst times, like he just always he's always a provider, man. And you know what? I'm so grateful for, for that. It's been times where like I've been like depressed or like I've been like what I thought was at my lowest and God came and, and rescued me. And I'm so grateful for that, man. But here's the thing about, you know, about us and God and, and just living your life in a day-to-day -day basis. Stop giving people discounts. Stop. It's time to stop giving people discounts. We give people discounts because we want to please people 24-7. They're not that's that's not on what you're selling. Sometimes you give them a discount on your time. You give them a discount on your energy. You give them a discount to be in your space when you know they don't deserve to be in your space. Stop giving people, stop giving people the discounted price of you. They're not, they not giving you no discount. Whether they're selling a t-shirt or whether they giving you their time or whatever they're doing. They're not selling, they're not giving you no discount. That's purple. They're not, they're not, they're not even worried about where your next discount, they, your next discount gonna come from because they already know when it comes to you, they can get one. Stop giving people the discounted version of you, cuz. Because you deserve so much freaking more. You know, people think they can just come in and just do what the hell they want to do in your life. And you know what, cuz? They can't. It's not fair to you. Because you decided that you this good of a person that you're going to continue to give people discounts and do all of these things. Just because you're a good person does not mean you have to continue allowing people to run over you, cuz. Or keep using you. It, just because you're a good person, you shouldn't feel guilty about what you can't do for somebody. You shouldn't. You, should, you shouldn't feel guilty of, of telling somebody no. You shouldn't. You shouldn't feel guilty of putting your damn foot down with people and saying, hey, this is how I want to be treated. Stop giving yourself the discounted, watered-down version to people. Because if that's how you got to present yourself to people, then those people don't need to be around you. Kick their ass to the curb. Yeah, you should. You should. Kick them to the curb. Oh, I forgot. Somebody said they can't see God in me because I'd be cursing. First of all, and that's another thing, too. God ain't called for the perfect. He didn't. God knew exactly how I was when he created me. I'm not on this camera disrespecting nobody in no different type of way. I might say some liberty cuss words, but you know what? I cuss in real life. That's who I am. But y'all people act like God stopped handing out blessings when he, stopped giving, when he started giving them to them. He didn't. He didn't. And I feel like if I'm not myself on this camera, you're getting a discounted version of me to make you comfortable. We're no longer doing that to people to make them comfortable. If they uncomfortable, let me tell you something. Is it the fact that we make them uncomfortable or are they just uncomfortable? Because if they're just uncomfortable, that don't have nothing to do with us. Their opinion of how they feel about us don't have nothing to do with us. You'll adjust. People, you people want you to adjust to them, don't they? They, they go up here around here, they living their life 24 7, doing what they want to do, and you got to adjust to the way they move and the things that they're doing, whether it's right or if it's wrong, they want you to adjust to them. But when it's time for people to adjust to you, now all of a sudden you acting different. Or you moving funny, or you shouldn't be doing it. God ain't stop handing out blessings when he gave them to you. He didn't. And nor is he going to stop blessing me because he knew exactly who he created. I'm, not, I'm no longer. And I'm taking you with me. We're no longer making, it's not our job to make people comfortable around us. It's not our job to make me, for me to make people feel comfortable sitting behind this table. Or behind this camera. It's not. My job is to be my complete 100% self. But stop giving people the watered down version of you. Because there's somebody out there that wants the best of you. Because this was a pretty size. I'm going to put it at the forefront. Somebody out here wants the best of you. And you're so used to giving people the watered down version of you or adjusted to how they want you to act that you're not, you're not being your complete self. Damn that! Be yourself! You should. You should be yourself. You should. You should be yourself. If you want to wear that kinky hair from the Dollar Tree or that kinky hair from that gas station, I say wait. They're going to talk about you anyway. They're going to do it. You know? If, if you want to order shorts from Sheen and Fashion Nova every day, I say do it. 
They're going to talk about you anyway. Give them something to talk about. I said, like, wow, what are you scared of? They ain't scared to judge you, so why are you scared of being judged? They're going to talk about you anyway. There you go. Open the door. Man, I'm in my own mouth. Now, I got a question. What's your favorite water? And don't sit up here and say, because all water tastes the same. No, it don't. Every time a natural disaster happened, they need to take the sunny off the shelf. Every time a natural disaster happened, the sunny, the only water left. What's your favorite water? Mine will be Fiji and Essential. I re I'm really not a water fan. I don't like it. I hate it. We all know that. But it allows me to do what I need to do. It goes down smooth. It goes down properly. It's just so damn high. How the hell water so high? I can't even use my left hand. How the hell water is so high? I just don't get it. Anyway, I'm going to go. I'm going to do it. I love y'all. I do. I love y'all so much. This is a purple potato, sweetie. This is a purple potato, sweetie. Ain't nobody out here eating purple potatoes. They all hell. I got this at Kroger. But this is a purple potato. You see that, ain't it? You learn something new every day. But it tastes just like a potato. I got this at the Kroger. They got them at the Kroger over there. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do it. I love it. It's not mine. It's anyone's. Any that can never take away. This is your fake cousin. Hey, this is your favorite cousin. I already know this. You already know what to do. God is loving. Don't forget to drink a bit for me. This is your favorite cousin. Let's get it. Teen curtains. What to shoot your ladies and gentlemen? I don't even know how my camera was set up because I didn't even turn on my um computer for a month or two today. I just kind of sat down and just enjoyed the day. Anyway, protect your peace. Happy freaking Tuesday. I love you so much from the bottom of my heart. I'll try to see you tomorrow. Let's get it.